Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time here, you're welcome. Today I'm going to be making box braid on a straight hair and I want to take you guys through the process. Here I'm showing you guys the extensions I'm going to be using. I actually ended up using three colors but I will you'll see that in the course of this video. So this is how I actually pre-picked it before my client came. She dropped her extensions the previous day and yeah i'm just showing you guys how i picked it i cut it into two because she wanted it long so here she's here and we are about to start so this is her hair and as i said i ended up using three colors because she just wanted mixed of all colors like we used silver we used brown and wine and the silver and brown i actually mix it together you can see how it is i mix the brown and silver and it looked so good guys guys at the end of this video you will love the outcome of the hair i would advise if you want to make use of colors do it be brave enough it comes out really really nice so i'm going to be making um medium sized braids as you can see I'm trying to section it out yes so i'm trying to make sure that the braids are actually okay yes so here we are starting just always make sure that you put the hair in a bun because you know their hair tends to um not put together and yeah it was quite fun making her hair guys she is a good friend we've known each other for a very long time and oh it was my first time making a hair with gisted and all of that good stuff. Guys, the outcome of silver and brown mixed together was actually very, very nice. It actually came out really nice. So, yeah, as you can see, I'm just starting. You will see well detailed as we go. So here i'm showing you guys i think i already have a video on this but i just wanted to show you guys the mixture of this color guys and also the process of how we made the hair it was looking so much but because of she was a lovely person the braids the timing did not matter it took us almost seven hours to make this hair guys it took us almost seven hours but at the end of the day we came out smiling and it was nice so feel free to mix colors it actually comes out really really nice if you notice when her friend passed her friend actually made hers the previous day that was when she dropped her braids and she she was making hers that same day so here i am braiding it down for about four times yes guys i braided it down for about four times you know your hair is kind of slippery so i would advise to braid it down properly before you continue to braid out i will always show you guys in the course of this video you see how many times it's better you braid down four good times so that it will be rooted properly because it's straight hair you don't want it pulling out So as you can see because of its long i keep making sure i detangle the ends so as not to get um, stuck so yeah as i braid i detangle to the ends and yeah here again i'm showing you guys how we mix the color guys this hair was popping it was so so nice so here i'm in front i always advise please always make sure that you part your um your part into box form as you know you're making box braid so always make sure that it's in it's parted into box form here is the color we are mixing it with this wine color oh my god guys I was we were spectacle about it but it came out really nice so here i'm showing you guys as i said braid down four times before you're losing your hand and start braiding out it makes everything really what it as you can see i'm braiding it out and 
I always make sure I section the hair properly. I'm doing it line by line. I know that people will say, ah, uh-uh, ah, but this will take a long time. No, guys, it's best you do that so that your clients will always come again and again. It will last them long. And you know, another thing is they wash their hair. As she told me, she wash she wash her hair like two times a week. So washing their hair on braids you should make sure that you make it really, really firm on the roots. Here I'm showing you guys again. I braid it down. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Exactly, you braid it down four times. As I said, they love to wash their hair, so make sure you braid it down uh, from the roots properly. She was telling me that she wants it really, really close in front, so I told her, of obviously, the front will be very close and all of that good stuff. She was looking at her hair and admiring it. So, guys, it's just the basic braid out the braids that we do i was telling her in front i'll always make it really section small guys it took a while because her hair was so much it took a lot of time but i just want my clients to be satisfied as you can see the color this color actually makes all of the stress really really nice like this color was so so nice i was not expecting it to be this nice but it came out really, really nice so guys i'm just showing you guys again the process and yeah as you can see the lines the box are well defined define your box properly because your client will want to pack her hair put it into ponytails so you want everything to blend properly please do not forget that section the hair properly it matters a lot and if you if you must say this color is actually nice the braids were so so nice and yeah i'm showing you guys again the process of making the braids holding it gripping it properly because you need to grip this properly as i said they wash their hair two times a week and yes if you are my client you have to come relax i make my place an eco-friendly um hairdressing place so here she's taking her popcorn and we're just in all true guys it didn't even feel as if we used up to seven hours because we we're so relaxed and chilled i knew that she was <laughs> it was a bit painful because she kept going off and on and all of that but at the end of the day we we're fine and we we're happy So here again, I'm showing you guys how I root it down. I know some people get, um, some people actually find it difficult on how to braid it and grip it properly. But I've always said, make sure that you grip, put your hand on the roots four good times, braid it before you start braid out. It's very important. You can see they are all firm and they look good. No matter how she wash this hair, she will actually take it for at least three to four weeks. That is the that is the goal because of the wash their hair, unlike we Africans. So braid it down four times. So I'm showing you guys the colors were popping. Oh my goodness, these colors are. So we are going on break now, and we'll be back so here she's back and yeah i will just take you guys through the process again the box form always make sure when you say box braid make sure you section your hair into box form that is what you mean as box braid and i will also give a tip here every line you go make sure make sure that each braid slap in between the braids you made previously that makes it covered very well if you understand like each section of braids that you make upper actually comes in between the two ones downwards so be careful about the sectioning it's just yeah it's just the process
that was my husband seated there yeah at the point we just had to gist and all of that stuff. so he was here and giving me moral support yes so leave in the comment section how many minutes it takes you to braid one braid i want to know how many minutes it takes you to braid one single braid i don't know i think it takes me less than a minute or thereabouts i don't know i've not timed myself but i think i'll time myself the next time i make braids yeah i'm going to do that and as i said this braid is actually into two i cut the extensions just into two so it's a long one i'm going to time myself but if you have any if you've actually timed yourself drop in this comment section let me know how many minutes it takes you to braid one single braid yes guys So if you have not subscribed at this point kindly subscribe i'll be bringing in so many detailed tutorials if you are not cyprus always hook me up i always put my instagram account down and yeah supposed to time this i don't know i'm supposed to time it so yes guys another one i'm braiding so i'm showing you guys again i braid it down one two three four before you let your hands out braid it down four times to grip it properly so yeah that's just the trick of um, braiding hair on a straight hair it's I know some people say it's stressful but it's what it is what it wants your client is happy yeah So guys here we are done you can see how lovely this looks thank you guys so much for watching give me a thumbs up and i will see you guys in my next video bye bye guys <laughs>